closer to Father Christmas. Oh, our Christmas tree looks wonderful. And our elf on the shelf is watching too. Cupcake surprise toys. George and Peppa, do you have homework today? No, Mummy Pig. But George and I do have very important work to do. Well, what is this very important work then? George and I are going to write our letters to Father Christmas this very afternoon. How lovely. It is very important to give Father Christmas lots of time to get all the presents ready. So writing your letter is important work. But Mummy Pig, just have one problem. What's that? We don't have a letter or an envelope to write to Father Christmas. Don't worry, Peppa and George. I have... two Father Christmas writing sets right here. Enjoy writing your letters. Dear Santa Claus, I have been a very good Piggy this year, I would like a tea set and a surprise. Love from Peppa. Now I'm going to put a sticker. Father Christmas loves snowflakes and I hope he likes my letter. Now it's your turn, George. Dear Father Christmas, I have been a very good piggy this year. I tidy my room every day and I am good, kind and helpful. Please can I have a racing car set and a surprise. Lots of love, George Pig. I will leave you and Rudolph a treat. Very good work, George and Peppa. Can you check our address? I want to make sure Father Christmas knows where we live. Everything looks great and the address is correct. I chose a green envelope for my letter. I chose a red envelope. If you go on your sleds now, you will be able to post your letters today. Now off you go, put on your coats. We will, Mummy Pig. Peppa and George are ready to go to the post box. Bye, Peppa and George. Have fun on your sleds. Bye, Bye Mummy Pig. Pig. Come on, George. We need to hurry. Otherwise, the letters won't arrive at the North Pole in time. Race you. Race you too. My sled can go really fast. Mine too. <laughs> <laughs> George have fun on their sleds. They meet their friends on the way to the post box. Hello, Danny Dog and Zoe Zebra. Hello, George and Peppa. Hello, Danny. What are you doing here? Are you out for a sled ride? We're on our way to the post box to mail our letters to Father Christmas. Oh, goody. George and I have our letters here too. We can all go together. As long as I'm first. <laughs> Ready, steady, go. Whee! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Stop, everyone. Look, Susie Sheep is over there. Hello, Susie. Are you on your way to the post box too? I sure am. Why don't you come with us? Of course, I'd love to. Did you make sure to bring your Christmas letter? I sure did. Well, what are we waiting for? Follow me. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and her friends arrive at the post box. Come on everyone, let's put our letters in the mailbox. You can go first, Danny. My letter is blue. I've asked for a racing car. I've got a yellow letter and I'm asking for a toy puppy. My letter is pink and I've asked Father Christmas for a doll's house. Peppa, can you help me mail my letter? Of course, George. And I've asked Father Christmas for a racing car set and a surprise. That 
That's a fun Christmas list, George. Now, Peppa, it's your turn to post your letter. Oh, where is my letter with my Christmas list inside? Oh, dear. Peppa has lost her Christmas list. Did I drop my letter on the ground? No, it's not here, Peppa. Maybe it's on your sled. My letter is not on my sled. It won't arrive in the North Pole on time. And then I'll get no present for Christmas. You can share my presents, Peppa. That's so kind, George. Peppa, maybe you lost it on your way to the post box. Oh, yes. Let's go back the way we came. Don't worry, Peppa. We'll find your letter. What color is your envelope? My letter is red. That's great. It will stand out in the snow. Come on, everyone. Let's go find Peppa's lost letter. Peppa and her friends are going to look for Peppa's lost letter. I can't see anything red. Let's check over here where you met me. That's a good idea, Susie. We're coming. The letter's not here. Oh no, I will never find my letter and Father Christmas won't know what I want for Christmas. <laughs> I'm confused. Since when do pine trees have red flowers? What are you talking about, George? Look over there. It might be your letter. Oh dear, George. That looks a lot like my Christmas letter. It must have flown up in the wind while we were on our sleds. It is your letter, Peppa. George, you saved the day. Thank you for finding my letter. Hooray for George. Now hurry, everyone. We have to get Peppa's letter to the post box. Peppa and her friends go back to the mailbox. They are just in time. Oh, at last, I'm posting my letter to Father Christmas. What did you ask for, Peppa? I asked for a tea set and a surprise. Oh, that's lovely, Peppa. Grandad Dog comes to collect the mail. Oh my, there's so many letters to collect today. That's because we've all posted our letters to Father Christmas. Father Christmas will be so happy to get those letters. I will go straight to the airport and make sure they go on the airplane to the North Pole tonight. So Father Christmas will have them in the morning. Thank you so much, Grandad Dog. Have you seen Father Christmas before? Not in person, but I've heard the bells of his reindeers fly overhead on Christmas Eve. Ooh. Do you know how old he is, Grandad? They say he is hundreds and hundreds of years old. Now I better be off, otherwise your letters won't get to Father Christmas in time. And you do want your presents, don't you? We do! Bye! Thank you all for helping me. You're welcome, Peppa. You're our special friend. Bye, Bye, everyone! Peppa and George arrive home. It is time to get their Christmas tree. Hello, Peppa and George. Did you get your letters to the post box on time? Well, I sure did. I did lose mine, but all our friends and George helped me find it. That's wonderful, Peppa. You do have great friends and a wonderful little brother. Well, it's time for us to go get our Christmas tree. Hooray! I love getting the Christmas tree. So let's all get it. We are here, my little piggies. Hello, everyone. Good evening, Mrs. Rabbit. So I guess you want a tree. Is it a holly tree, a plum tree, or an apple tree you need? Oh, no, Miss Rabbit. We would like a Christmas tree. In fact, we would like a perfect Christmas tree. A perfect Christmas tree? We have a wonderful selection of Christmas trees. Come see. 
Sounds like a plan. These are the smaller Christmas trees I have. They look lovely. They are way too small. Here are the next size of Christmas trees. These are lovely. I like these trees. Hmm, still too small. Hmm, oh wait, I do have one very special tree. Let me show you. This is the biggest of all the trees. This tree is perfect. Wow, that is a really big tree. It sure is. Will you be able to put it in your car? Absolutely. My car is right over here. I really think this tree is too big for the car, Daddy Pig. Silly Peppa, I'm sure we can squeeze it in. Well, maybe the tree is a little too big for the car. I told you, Daddy Pig. I think we should get a different Christmas tree. Nonsense, Mummy Pig. I know, I will carry the tree to our house. Goodbye, Daddy Pig. See you soon, Daddy Pig. This tree is not that heavy. The tree is very heavy and it takes a long time for Daddy Pig to get home. Oh dear, this Christmas tree is rather heavy and it's a long way to our house. Hmm, it's getting late now and Daddy Pig still isn't home. He's been gone for ages, Mummy Pig. I hope our tree is okay. What is that noise? <clears throat> it's Daddy Pig with our Christmas tree. Will the tree fit in our house, Daddy Pig? I will make sure it does. Now let's get this tree inside so we can all decorate it together. There, our Christmas tree is here at last. Where are our Christmas tree decorations, Mummy Pig? They're right here in the Peppa Pig Christmas letter egg. Let me get them for you. We have these beautiful silver baubles and these purple baubles, they're chocolate balls. Yummy. Have fun decorating. I love putting on the purple baubles because they have chocolate inside. Yummy. I love putting red Christmas bubbles on the tree. I'll put on the Christmas lights. And I will put on the Christmas star. Oh, our Christmas tree looks wonderful. It sure does. Well done, Daddy Pig. Now you little piggies must get to bed. Remember, Father Christmas and his elves are watching. We know, and our elf on the shelf is watching too. She sure is. Now get to bed quickly so she can tell Father Christmas what good piggies you are. Peppa and George love writing their Christmas lists and putting up their tree. Children, have you written your Christmas list? So kids, I really hope you enjoyed Peppa Pig and the Lost Christmas List and also going to get her big Christmas tree. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you never miss our weekly Peppa Pig videos. Bye, I love you kids. Don't forget to subscribe, it's free. Here's some more fun videos.